Welcome to Align Christ-Centered Yoga. My name is Linda and I'll be guiding our practice today. Today's practice is a memory verse flow. We are memorizing scripture as we connect it to breath and movement. And today's scripture verse comes to us from Proverbs 31. Proverbs 31, 9. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. Throughout Jesus' life, he was drawn to the disenfranchised. He wanted justice for the poor. He reached out to the outcasts of his society, and he asks us to do the same, to speak up for those who cannot find their voice or whose voices are not heard. He asks us to judge fairly and to defend the rights of the poor and the needy. I invite you to find your sitting bones. Maybe you elevate your hips up on a blanket or a block. Rock a little bit side to side, front to back. As you find the sitting bones, begin to find alignment. Create a little space between the vertebra as you inhale and let the head rise to the sky, shoulders over hips. Let the elbows fall underneath the shoulders so they're not forward or back. Hands softly on the legs. I invite you to close your eyes. For a moment, just think about this word justice. What is your response to it? How do you feel about justice? Begin to find your breath. Breathing in and out through the nose, deepen the breath. Breathing fully into the rib cage. Opening up from head to pelvis. And then exhale, drawing the belly in, softening the rib cage, emptying the lungs. Find your breath. One more deep breath here. Begin to connect breath and movement. Taking a deep breath in, let the arms rise up and overhead. And exhale, bring the hands down. Press into that right hand. Bring that left arm over to the side. And then the right. Begin to lengthen through the sides of the body as you inhale up. Inhale underneath those arms, push up with those serratus muscles. Exhale, let the arms float down. Press the earth away from you as that right hand comes to the mat and reach that left arm, stretching from fingertips to hip. And go the other direction. Again, arms rising and falling, begin to connect it with the scripture verse. Speak up. Judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and the needy. And one more time. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. As you're ready, release. Go ahead and come off the block. Bringing the hips um, down to the mat. Bring the feet together. Let's explore butterfly pose. So we're going to work through a warrior two flow today. Stretch and strengthen the muscles of the inner thigh, the hamstrings. Take a nice deep breath in and let those legs settle. Exhale and soften. And if you're a little tight here, maybe you support the legs with a block. I invite you to lengthen through the spine as you fold over. So rather than collapsing down, rather than softening shoulders and lowering the head, 
Keep that heart lifted forward. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. One more breath here. You ready? Hands come underneath, knees come up. Go ahead and bring the blocks to the front. Bring that right leg out to the side. Left foot comes inside, activating the muscles of this extended leg. So that quadricep tightens up. The knee draws a little closer to the hip. The heel presses away. Exhaling, draw forward. Inhaling back. Back and forth here. you're ready, come forward and stay. Finding your hamstring stretch. So bend the knee a little bit if you need to. Maybe there's even a block or a blanket underneath it. Can you extend a little more through the spine? Stay here for another breath. Gently press into the hands and come up. Bring the feet forward. Bounce the knees, windshield wiper the feet, and stay here for a breath. Check in, notice how the body feels, how the breath moves. Go ahead and bring that left leg over to the side, bringing that right foot in, turning the body towards the leg. Again, activating the muscles, quadriceps, tightening up, pulling in, heel, pressing out. Exhale forward, inhale back, back and forth here. As you're ready, come forward and settle. The head come down, shake the head out, no, and yes, find your breath. One more breath here, continuing to soften the muscles of the legs to lengthen the back. And as you're ready, release and press into the hands and come back. Meet me in table. Wrists are directly underneath the shoulders, knees are directly underneath the hips. From here, begin to find cat, rounding the spine up to the sky, top of the head reaching towards the mat. And cow, chest moving through the arms, gaze coming forward. And two more times here, cat to cow. As you're ready, meet me at center, curling the toes under, draw knees up into the rib cage. Begin to lengthen through the spine. And again, find length up and down the sides of the body. Maybe the fingers point, pointer fingers point towards the front corners of the mat. Can you draw the shoulder blades back? Rotate the biceps in towards each other. Begin to pedal through the feet. Checking in, noticing how the legs feel, the calf muscles, the hamstrings. Taking a deep breath in, heels rise, and exhaling, let the heels come down towards the mat. Stay here for two more breaths, just checking in, just noticing how downward facing dog feels. On that next inhale, the right leg rises high. And gaze forward, bring the foot all the way through. Let that back knee come down and up. 
opening up through the hip and the back leg. Notice any sensations in that psoas muscle in the front of the hip. Just let that knee come down top of the foot to the mat and begin to straighten and bend the front leg, half split. And as you're ready, find your hamstring stretch here. Two more breaths, realigning the hips, drawing them towards the center of the mat, lengthening through the spine. And bring the knee over the ankle, raise that back leg up, bring the front foot to the back, meet me in plank. And from plank, I invite you to come down to your knees and come all the way down to the mat. Forearms to the side of the mat, fingers spread wide. Round the shoulders a little forward as the chest comes off the mat. Push the chest through as the shoulder blades rotate under and around. Exhale down one more time, finding Sphinx. Settling into Sphinx pose for two breaths. Activating the muscles of the upper back, activating the muscles of the feet and the legs. Exhale, release, hands to rib cage, draw back to table, curl the toes under, meet me in downward dog. Checking in, noticing the right side of the body compared to the left. Deep breath in, left leg rises high. Gaze forward, foot comes all the way through, back knee taps down and up. And then as you're ready, just leave that back knee down. Draw the hips slightly forward, top of the foot to the mat lengthening through the spine, and begin to straighten and bend the front leg. So as we get ready for this warrior two sequence, stretching the hamstrings, the hip, go ahead and extend that leg, find length. One more breath here. Knee over ankle, curl the toes under in the back. Go ahead and bring the front foot to the back. Meet me in plank. Maybe you come down straight leg. Maybe you are still on your knees. Maybe you're still in sphinx. Maybe you are in low cobra. Hands to rib cage. Meet me back in downward facing dog. And shake the head out. No and yes. And find breath. On that next inhale, right leg rises high. Gaze forward, foot comes all the way through the hands, rise into your lunge. Exhale, hands to thigh. Go ahead and push the muscles of the quadriceps towards the knee. Raise that back thigh to the sky. Find your balance. Shoulders over hips, abs in, arms rise. From here, bring the hands out to the side. Pivot that back foot so that it is parallel to the outside edge of the mat. Front knee is still over the ankle. Go ahead and draw this back hip um, behind you and then rotate it as that hip point comes forward. You're gonna internally rotate this back hip. Front hip externally rotates, knee right over the ankle. Drop that back arm, peaceful warrior. Reach forward, stretch through the sides of the body, side angle bend. One more time. Bring the hands all the way around to either side of the foot. Say the scripture verse as you move through your flow back to downward facing dog. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. Hands back to rib cage. Breathe your way back to downward facing dog. One breath here. 
On that next inhale, the left leg rises high. Gaze forward, foot comes all the way through the hands. Rise into lunge. Find the lunge. Hands to thighs, just move the muscles towards the knee. Raise that back thigh towards the um, sky. Shoulders over hips, arms rise. Pivot the back foot. Find warrior two. Go ahead and press a little bit through the outside edge of that back foot. Again, you're going to lean this hip a little bit back and then just rotate as that hip point comes forward. Externally rotate as this front knee comes over the ankle. From here, peaceful warrior, lengthen through the side of the body. Maybe you even find a bind. Go the other direction. One more time. Pivot around. Back foot comes to the front. Meet me in forward fold. Shake your head out no and yes. Hands to shins, rise up halfway and exhale down. Push through the feet, breathe into those arms, reach all the way up, palms together. And exhale, forward fold. Hands to shins, rising up halfway. Exhale down. Meet me in plank. Say the scripture verse through the flow. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. As you come back to downward facing dog, stay there for three breaths. Check in. Notice what you notice. Make any adjustments you need to. Maybe your hips reach a little bit more to where the ceiling meets the wall. Maybe you can press through the big toe and little toe and lift those middle toes off the mat. Let's work through the arch. Deep breath in, right leg rises high, gaze comes forward, foot comes all the way through. Rise up, meeting me in lunge. <clears throat> Bring the arms out to the side, pivot into warrior two. Peaceful warrior side angle bend, add the scripture verse. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. I invite you to come forward. We're gonna come into side angle bend. From here, we're gonna go into triangle. So if you'd like a block, you know, maybe that block comes to the inside of the foot. That is an option for you. And that next inhale, straighten out that front leg. Find breath. And then as you're ready, come back into that peaceful warrior. Go ahead and cartwheel the hands over. <clears throat> Front foot comes to the back, meet me in plank. From plank, come down to the mat. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. Shake your head out no and yes. On that next inhale, left leg rises high. Gaze comes forward, meet me in lunge. Find a strong and balanced lunge. Hands come out to the side, pivot into your warrior two. Peaceful warrior, side angle bend. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. Come over into that side angle bend again, you know, maybe you have a prop, maybe you don't need one and you'll come into unsupported triangle. Whatever is right for you, maybe one side is different than the other, meet me in triangle. Find your lunge, come back. Cartwheel the hands to either side of the foot, pivot that back foot, meet me in forward fold. Come up halfway, connect to the scripture verse. Speak up, forward fold, and judge fairly. 
meet me in extended mountain. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. Hands to heart, I invite you to stop, to stay here for three breaths, to check in noticing the effects of the practice so far on the body, mind, and soul. Maybe you can slow the heart rate down as you slow the exhale down. Maybe you can push down a little bit more with the feet. Deep breath in, arms rise. Exhale, forward fold. Hands to shins, rise up halfway. and Exhale down, one leg back and then the other. Meet me in plank from plank. Come down to the mat. Find your back bend. And find your way back to downward facing dog. Moving through the flow one more time, adding to it, right leg rises high, gaze comes forward in between the hands, rise into your warrior, or rise into your lunge, pivot into your warrior. Peaceful warrior, side angle bend. Again, connecting to the scripture verse. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. Find your triangle pose. From triangle pose, come back into Peaceful Warrior. And from here, point the feet towards the wide edge of the mat and meet me, actually they're angled slightly towards the corners. Whoops, whoops. <laughs> and meet me in your plie. From here, take the arms all the way up. Exhale down. Bend that back knee, extend the front leg. Begin to find a stretch in the inner thigh. Maybe that front heel, that back heel, left heel lifts. Right. Maybe you find balance here. Hands come down to the mat. Pivot everything towards that front leg. Drop the back knee. Find a half split. Bend the front leg. Bring the back foot forward. Meet me in forward fold. Shake the head out, no, and yes. Hands to shins, rise up halfway. Exhale down, deep breath in. Add the scripture verse, speak up and judge fairly, hands to heart, forward fold, defend the rights of the poor and needy. Come up halfway, exhale down, one leg back and then the other, meet me in plank, however you choose it, come to the mat. Choose your back bend and meet me back in downward facing dog. And stay here for two breaths. So final time through. So we added that inner thigh stretch. We added that half split hamstring stretch. Deep breath in, left leg rises high. Foot comes all the way through. Join me in your lunge. Pivot into warrior two. Peaceful warrior, side angle bend. One more time, add the scripture verse. Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of the poor and needy. Top arm rises, bottom arm comes down. Find your triangle, stay here for a breath. And the knee over the ankle, come back into that peaceful warrior. Come to the wide edge of the mat, toes facing the corners of the mat. Find your plie, cactus arms. Deep breath in, rise. Exhale, forward fold. 
Come to the back edge of the mat. Flex that front foot. Lift that back heel. Hands to heart. Find balance. Hands back to the mat. A little weight in the hands as you shift the weight towards that front leg. Pivot. Drop that back knee. Find your hamstring stretch. Bend the front leg, raise the back leg. One final time, back foot comes to the front, forward fold. Hands to the shins, rise up halfway. Exhaling, come down, deep breath in, rise high, palms together. Exhale, hands to heart. Final time here in mountain. How well do you advocate for those those whose voices who are not heard, those who don't have the resources that they need. How well do you advocate for those whose voices are not heard? How quickly do you judge and do you judge fairly? Do you defend the rights of the poor and the needy? One more breath here. Taking a deep breath in, arms rise, exhaling, forward fold. Hands to shins, rise up halfway, exhale down. Meet me in plank from plank. Come down to your knees, child to table twice. Stay in child's pose for five breaths. Adjusting the pose a little bit, knees come wider or narrower. Where are those arms? Are they in front of you or behind you? Maybe massaging out the head. I invite you to stay here for two more breaths. Gently press into your hands and rise up. Go ahead and bring those legs forward. Take the feet a little bit wide, drop the knees side to side. A little bit of a lower body twist here to release any tension in the back and the hips. And then as you're ready, come down to the mat onto your back. Draw your knees into your chest, your feet off the floor and gently press the knees back and forth here. Restoring a neutral position of the spine. Let the feet come down to the mat. Extend the legs long. Go ahead and windshield wiper the feet and bounce the knees. Wiggle the hips. Taking a deep breath in. Arms rise. Lift those shoulders off the mat and thump them down. And do that one more time. Exhaling. Hands softly come down to your hips. Palms up. Fine breath. As you settle into Shavasana, just consider this call for justice. Our God is a God of justice. And it is for that reason that Jesus left heaven to come to earth for us, to pay the price for our sin, to advocate for us, poor and needy.
I invite you to stay here a little longer if you can. If you need to move on with your day, begin to wiggle fingers and toes. Rotate wrists and ankles. Turn your head side to side. Taking a deep breath in, bring those arms up and overhead and just stretch as long as you can. Bend your knees and roll over onto your side. Find your breath as you support your head with an arm. Gently press into your hands and rise up to a sitting position. Just crossing your legs comfortably, finding your sitting bones. Checking in one final time, body, mind, and soul. What has changed since you came to the mat today? There's also what has stayed the same, accepting it as it is. A deep breath in, arms rise, palms together, and exhale, hands to heart, drawing your hands into prayer, bowing your head and joining me in prayer. Holy God, you are a God of justice, and we are so grateful for your grace and mercy in our lives. Help us to judge fairly. Give us the courage to speak out against injustice, to give voice to those whose voices are not heard. Help us to be advocates for the poor and the needy. Open our eyes and our ears to the injustices of this world, that we may speak out against us and bring your kingdom to earth. It is in the name of Jesus the Christ that we pray. Amen. Thank you for practicing with me today.